Also tonight, San Jose is honoring community service officer Long Pham. He was killed by a suspected drunk driver while on the job. It is the first time in the San Jose Police Department's history that a community service officer was killed in the line of duty. NBC Bay Area's Jocelyn Moran was at his memorial. Please come on up. Tonight, friends, family, and co-workers remembering community service officer Long Pham at the Vietnamese Heritage Garden. He was killed at the beginning of August by a suspected drunk driver while doing traffic control for an accident. We only shared a brief moment together. I distinctly remember his warmth and his smile. They are impermanent. City leaders were here tonight, including Mayor Matt Mahan, former Mayor Sam Licardo, and Interim Police Chief Paul Joseph. He was a member of our San Jose PD family. Captain Spears, who oversees community service officers, also spoke tonight on the kind of person Officer Pham was. His infectious smile and charisma had a way of brightening even the toughest of days, reminding us all of the power of kindness and dedication. Councilman Bien Duan organized tonight's vigil, saying that Officer Pham's loss is devastating to the community. We don't have a whole lot of police officers who are Vietnamese. And when we have a death like this, it's impact all of our lives, from the younger generation to the, to the older generation. The driver also hit and injured community officer Veronica Bear. She was released from the hospital after four days of intensive care. We also had a second CSO out there that night who was willing to risk it all in the name of saving, keeping this community safe, Veronica Bear. She was very seriously injured and fortunately did survive. Tonight, police officers, community service officers, and others in the community honored Officer Pham, a person people tonight described as compassionate and inspiring. And his memory will forever be cherished in our hearts. In San Jose, Jocelyn Moran, NBC Bay Area News.